guys, what is up? This is Juicy Fruit here, and today I'm going to be covering three things. Uh, one, being the background here, as you can see, it says Juicy Fruit, and it's a very nice, uh, bright, purplish color, <laughs> violet. And I really liked it. Uh, this guy made it for me, the number one fear. I'll leave his channel in the description below. Go check him out. Go subscribe to him. Um, he makes some Battlefield 2 and other uh, gameplays as well. Um, and he makes some beastly... Uh, wallpapers for your desktop so it's pretty awesome he also actually uh, uh, made my icon for my channel as well it's just juicy so <laughs> that's pretty awesome thanks dude and yeah <clears throat> number two I'm gonna be covering an updated updated uh, I guess method of installing texture packs alright so as you can see here this is the old one the 1.1.12 under score 02 and basically it shows the uh it's the old one where you just click um choose texture pack you choose a texture pack and you click patch and then it patches it and you open up minecraft and you play with the new texture pack but with this new uh minecraft beta or 2.0 beta you, click, you double click it and you'll see uh you'll see this window pop up right now all right it's, it's a lot different, trust me, it's a lot different than the uh, the old one. And uh, as you can see, it has the Mods tab, or the Options tab, the Log tab, the Class Map, and the Patch Summary tab. What you want to do, as soon as you get this window, is go to Mods and click Patch. Now, I've already clicked on Patch, so I'm not going to do it again. But that's what you need to do. You need to click on Patch. I'm, I think I might do that again, just for the hell of it. Alright, click on Patch. And what you want to do is... Go to, uh, I guess for Max, go to Finder, go to Library, Application Support, and Minecraft. Uh, for PC, I'm pretty sure it's like the uh, percent app data percent, and you go to Minecraft. Same thing, you know, it's where your bin folder is, where your saves folder, your resources folder, you know where it's at. Go to Texture Packs, just follow what I'm doing. Just after you click Patch, just go here, just go to uh, Minecraft under Application Support, go to Texture Packs, and just Dump in whatever texture pack you want. Like I have a bunch of stuff here: Jadoku, um, Scribblecraft, whatever texture packs you want in this folder. All right, and I click out of it and click also out of Minecraft Patcher 2.0. Now what you want to do is go ahead and open up Minecraft itself. I have an extra window up here. Let's close out of that. Yeah, as you can see, I'm gonna open up Minecraft, <clears throat> enlarge it, log in up my account. There's the Mojang sign, and boom, title screen. Come on, title screen. Yikes. <laughs> this is really slow. I don't know why. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, Minecraft. Now, as you can see, if you go to texture packs or mods and texture packs, you'll see that your texture packs are actually listed here. So you don't actually have to, um, for HD texture packs, you don't need to keep on clicking, um, uh, excuse me, keep on clicking patch, um, by opening up the, uh, the MC patcher. Now all you need to do is MC patcher, patch, close out of that, go to your percent app data percent or application support under Minecraft, go to texture packs, install all of these, whatever you want, just dump it in the folder, and then boom, you're done. This, and you can just click on whatever and you'll install it directly. No hassle. It's right there. It's so much easier, so convenient, it's ridiculous. And now as you can see, I have Minecraft for Kids on, and if I click Done, as you can see, the title menu is also different. Now if I go to Mods and Texture Packs, go to Jared Doku, Done, and as you can see, the title menu is different as well. It's so easy. Go ahead and try it out for yourself. It's easy, it's awesome. Um, awesome job by Core, I think that's his name, but he, not not Zhao, somebody else uh, made, this, uh, made this client, so it's awesome. Go ahead and try it for yourself. I'll leave the links in the description. And like I said, go check out the guy who made the background for me. It's, it's you know, show him some love, show him some support. All right, guys. All right, finally, finally, I need to, uh, I want to address something to you guys. Facebook. Oh, my God. Come on. All right. Uh, I made a new Facebook account specifically for this channel. If you go to Facebook and you type in Juicy Fruit, 
I don't want to. I don't want to show you guys my uh, actual account information and stuff. So I'm just gonna type in Facebook Juicy Fruit and hope that it shows up. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I don't know. But um, I'll leave the link in the description as well. And I want you guys to definitely go to the uh, to the page and I click the like button so, so I can update you guys on much more awesome stuff. I guess that I'm not gonna be able to upload. Uh, yeah, here we go. And as you can see here, um, the name is Juicy Food. It's a page. Uh, only one person has liked it so far, and I don't. I'm really. <laughs> that's really saddening, and it's disappointing as well. But uh, if you go to, uh, you know, go to Juicy Food on their Facebook, I'll leave the I'll leave the link in the description. So go ahead and please like it. Just spam the like button. I need more support, guys. I really want to get this Facebook page up. For you guys so you guys can go and check it out whenever you want I have a lot of discussions already um, I have a bunch of questions I have a bunch of things that I want you guys to ask such as uh, you know your opinions on my videos your video suggestions and I want you guys to introduce yourselves as well to the community so that other people will be able to get to know you as much as I will be able to get to know you guys better um, micro video suggestions you know just a bunch of stuff here that I, I want to, you know your feedback on uh, I made this two days ago, so I want you guys to definitely go and check it out. Um, you know, click the like button, please click the like button. It will really support me and help me out. I'll definitely be updating stuff here. I'll like a bunch of stuff here, um, and yeah, we'll have a lot of fun with that. So yeah, guys, like I said, go subscribe to the background maker and try installing the texture pack the the updated way. And go like me, go like this page on Facebook. It's juicy fruit. All right, guys. Thanks a lot. Peace.